Rick. Where's my bow tie? There's no bow tie in here. The tie will be there. Just calm down. Oh, yeah, right. Calm down. What have I got to be calm about, eh? It's only the rest of my life I'm throwing away if I make the wrong decision. It's not a wrong decision. And besides, mate, this is the 90s. No one takes that till death do us part stuff seriously anymore. It's a really reassuring thought, Rick. Oh, come on, Mark. You know what I mean. Look, if someone, not, not talking you, just, just someone, does eventually realise he's made a mistake, well, getting unmarried these days isn't a big deal. Thanks, Rick. Get to the point, you're not helping. But you know what would help if you could find me that tie? Ah, done. I told you the tie will be here. It's not a bow tie. Yes, it is, mate. It's a real one. You've got to tie it yourself. Hey? D just relax, mate. There's a diagram here. Just have your breakfast and I'll read up on it. It's burnt. Uh, I'm not hungry anyway. <sighs> Rick, have you ever wondered what makes people want each other so obsessively? Uh, I mean, you know, I mean, look at me and Annalise. We argue all the time and yet we can't survive without each other. It's almost like, you know, there's something missing. Some giant hole in the relationship. And it's almost like we kind of need each other as a patch to cover it over. Mark, listen to me. Stop thinking. Don't even think about thinking. This isn't the time to think. Just eat and you feel better.